It's a Sunday and we're on Buchanan Shopping Street, Pedestrian Street. Gorgeous, gorgeous day. Look at those buildings. Really stunning old buildings. I love it when they tell you where you are. There's a great information office right on Buchanan Street. They'll help you get rooms, things to see and do, train schedules, a million brochures. What I've got so far, and there it is, like a moon. I'll never get that out of my mind. This gorgeous old building was this ticket office for the subways. Enox. Subway station, and it dates from 1896. It has elements of Scott's baronial and Art Nouveau style. Carnival, mini carnival right in front here, but I love the old facades. Central Station is the other train station here in Glasgow. One of my viewers can answer me, how long does it really take to learn how to play bagpipes? St. Enoch Station. If all the other gazillion stores aren't enough, then just mosey into Princess Square. We're in George's Square. We got very turned around, which is a good thing because you get to walk around and see exactly what's in Glasgow. These are the city chambers. The whole exhibition here is from Charles Rummy Mackintosh, very famous designer. He designed many of the buildings that you see around Glasgow. Very great staircase all the way up to the top. The lighthouse was built for the Glasgow Herald, which is a newspaper, between 1893 and 1895 when Charles Rennie Mackintosh was working for architects. It used the building until 1980. It had a stationary steam engine in the basement to drive the presses, and Rennie built the 8,000 gallon water tank. And it's called the Lighthouse, this building, because it lights culture for people. We did climb up the 135 steps. Nice items that they sell down here. The shop is called Spittlefields. Little displays, old sewing machines. 